Actually, the track in here looks clean, doesn't it? So far. <laughs> Uh, yeah, the track looks great. And it just gets worse. Right here. Uh, this we're gonna need to clean this up, aren't we? Maybe, yeah. Yeah, we're gonna. It's not too no, but we're gonna need to clean. We're gonna need to clean this area up. why we brought a pick. Yeah, I can do it Okay. Is this it here? I thought it was this way. I believe. Yeah, it is. Watch your feet here. Good. Maybe a couple rocks. I mean, Doesn't this good. need to go out that way? Mm -hmm. The switch is missing, right? Yeah, there's not any. I don't think it could go the wrong way right here, per se. I don't think. We've been looking at some of the individual levels of this mine. There's 10 levels below us. Each level is several miles. This is the top level. This is the hoist. And the hoist room. The hoist. We're going to look around this level a little bit. There's a workshop back there. There's a lunch room and the controls and all that for the hoist. The copper scrappers have been in here, so unfortunately it's a little bit trashed. Today's project is we're going to try and move this, try and power this up on the lithium iron phosphate battery packs, but there's a bunch of damage to it caused by uh, copper thieves. The wires are all cut. would have been quite the place if it hadn't been vandalized.
this is the cage's approximate placement in the shaft. And then that pointer right there on the drum fine tunes the actual stopping point. So when that pointer down there is lined up, the cage is in the right spot. Massive con contactors that they stole all the contacts off because they were silver. These are probably resistor packs. See the lunch room here for the miners to eat. This is the workshop. I would estimate there's a minimum of 75 miles of track below us in the 10 levels below us. And we're going to cover most of those levels. Drill bit sharpening machine, and that's where they tested the drill bits. This is the charger generator for the trammer. copy that and then here's the trammer Mancha little trammer electric locomotive number two we're gonna try and get this one running and take it for a spin <laughs> this one's been vandalized by copper thieves so a lot of the uh, Copper wire has been, compromised. yeah, compromised or harvested. So we're going to have to kind of reverse engineer this and figure out where to feed it power. So this is the speed control. We think maybe we can. Is there something? Hmm. Harder. So yeah, these must be the different taps on the motor. Yep. It's pretty fancy how it works, for sure. Hear that? <laughs> yeah. That's just that grease on it. This is the grease. So both, because this is a reversing switch, both both the positive and negative have to feed into this in order for it to reverse. So all we have to do is figure out where the two wires feed in and feed it into here. But yeah, all the, all the wires have been cut. You know, I... I'm wondering if this goes directly to the motor, these two wires, and these used to come over to mm -hmm. the controller, and then from the controller to the battery. And charger, because this does have the charger installed on it. Yeah. Look. Okay, I see a big bundle of wires down here. Coming out of the switch pack, going into the motor. So all we have to do Okay, here are all the wires right here. Okay. They're all tapped on to the different... We found two wires here that run into that main loom, in black and white. This battery is tapped every 3.3 volts, and the total pack is 40 volts, the same as the two lead acid batteries that are in here. So what we might do, well, let me try this first. So I'm clipped onto positive here. I just want to see if it does not appear to be a short. The capacity of this battery is about 15 amps, but 
if you short it, it'll put out 2,000 amps. Okay, so why don't you put it on low? Okay, yeah, ready? I'm gonna, ooh, turn it off. So yeah, it's definitely, it's definitely doing something when you turn the switch on. We just gotta be real careful. Okay, go go ahead, but be ready to pull back if if it something happens. Hold on, let me get back a little bit here. Ooh, look at the fire in there yeah, when you. Yeah, that's. But go, go do it again, but go further. Go like. I'm trying to make sure there's nothing in front. Okay. Sorry. I just don't want to get us hung up on something stupid because there's a lot of stupid cable right here. Just in case, you know. Other than that, I think we're good, right? Yeah, we look good. I don't know if this battery's going to okay. take us very far, but we'll see. But yeah, go ahead. Go. Okay. All right. So this, it's uphill a little bit to here, but then it looks like we... Ang yeah, we angle downhill here. We have a bridge here. We're a little bit concerned about driving this two-ton instrument over. We can go. We can. You can climb and, and see the structure of it through this hole. Okay. On the other side. Okay. So. So it doesn't look like it's, it looks like it's kind of falling apart a little bit. That's all I'm worried about. Look, this part here is the main support for the, for this side of the bridge. You can see the wire here. Oop. And it goes down. Actually, there's a ladder that goes up right here. Okay, got it. Oh, I see. Okay, it's, it's supported from, from above. And it's braced. And see this? This is um, yeah, good for the bracing. And then are we clear all the way to... We're clear all the way out? Um, uh, this was the worst of it that I, that I saw. Okay. This, and there's like... Uh, yeah, I'd say so. I'll go ahead. If you're rolling down, I'll go ahead and... and uh, Check the rest. So I went right up, right there is where I stopped. Okay. Ken here is cleaning the track up. Let me grab the so maybe what we'll do is we'll br we'll bring it up to the bridge here. Is that a bell? <laughs> no, I wouldn't. <laughs> We're we're good. The question is is how far will the battery get it? What this will do is this is telling us the voltage of each cell right now. Is that showing up in there? Mm -hmm. So what we'll do is we'll set an alarm so So at 2.7 volts, this thing is going to start screaming. When we get to 2.7 volts, this thing will alarm us to back off. Mm -hmm. 
Why don't we play with the brake? Yeah, just that would feel a little safer because I was getting try, pretty good. Try the handle on the, try the handle on, or, I, I'm not sure. Try oh, that, yeah. try that one right there. Okay. okay. Not that one. Okay. I'll try this one now. Okay, maybe I should try pulling on that. Is that? Yep. Ooh, that stops it pretty good, yep. doesn't it? Yes, it does. Uh, keep your hand on the handle. <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's designed to roll downhill. Oh yeah, it's going. <laughs> I just don't want it going too fast. Because there's a split right here, so. We're down to 19.7 volts, so it's chewing away at it pretty good. What we're interested in is getting across this bridge without any of us being on it. We don't want to take the risk. People. Yeah, 2,000 pounds or more going across this with somebody on it. So we're trying to figure out how to do it. Um, is that door going to be in the way right there? This? Yeah. yeah. we can move that. Alright, so I will engage the tram by putting the lever probably to a bite about here because I don't want to send it at you too fast. Mm -hmm. Now when it gets to the other side, you, you put it there. right back to this neutral position. If it's going too fast, you can even, this is your brake. Okay. And it stops it right now. Okay, cool. Then I'll stand on the right side, or the left side. Yes, the left side. Okay, <laughs> we're ready to die. Perfect execution. For some reason, oh, crap. I think we lost. I think we, yeah, you watch. Whoa. I'm gonna have to get off because I'm, I'm gonna hit my head. It's for the hell of it. Take it up wide open. Wait, 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 wait. Maybe, maybe, whoa, shit. Maybe we should, whoa. <laughs> you guys are all Did we derail it? Yeah, it's derailed all the way on one side. 
Yeah, it's on the tracks on this side. Yeah, we just need to lift it up. It might actually go, actually. Oh, go back on? It, yeah. Right? You need something to for this well, well, to Go, go forward. Or do you want me to go backwards? I don't know. No, go forward. Uh, then I'll watch the track. What derailed it? Right, uh, I thought maybe this. No, that is, it's, the track is wide enough where it comes in, where it transitions. Oh, right so here. this wasn't over far enough, right? Or something. See, see that bolt right there? It's, I don't know what happened. And yeah, it, it wasn't, it oh, up. look. Oh, yeah. That's it's what broken. happened. <laughs> well, no, it was already loose. <laughs> So, maybe backwards. Um, because we need this to get us back up. But yeah, it's going up. Okay, Mark, and then I'll jam. We'll jam this over somehow once okay. you get it up. Let's get on. Uh, oh, it'll go up too. It'll go a little farther. You gotta go. Oh, now, this, this sank down, that spread. Yeah, that's what it is. It's right here because this needs to be up here. Okay, we'll jam it up. We'll right? It. Wedge up better like this. You want to try that? I should. Sure. Well, yeah. I saw a couple places they had wood or something jammed holding the track like that. Oh. No, it's, uh, it, it's, it can't stand. I don't know. Yep, oh. it's down. This side's keeping it from falling off. You're good. It's just riding right on the edge. Yeah, I know. It can't go any further. Yeah, you're 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 good. It's there. Now we're on. Yeah. I don't know, it kind of looks like quartz to me. Oh, what do yeah, you... the sparkly. Yeah, it's quartz. Sparklies. It's not my favorite sparkles. But Sparklies you know. are cool. Okay. Continuing on, you ready? Why don't you stop right there and we'll take a walk and we'll see if it's clear because we're in the home stretch right now. You know what's weird about it? That's good. It's it's totally quiet. Mm -hmm. It's totally smooth, Very and it's just raw torque. Yep. It's like an electric car. Yeah. But better. <laughs> okay, I might have to lean towards you because that shoot. Just so you know. Ready? Yep. Come 
want to see what she'll do? Let's go. Is that it? Is that wide open? Oh, no, I'm not yet. I'm just trying to get past that board. And we have a split up here. I don't know. Here we go. Wide open. It's getting it too. Gonna take it backwards here. So we're going uphill a little bit. Can you see what our voltage is when it goes to the all 18.7 okay you want to know how scary it is riding backwards is it weird <laughs> Okay, we've been rolling this around for a half hour, 45 minutes, and we still, we're not dead here. We haven't hit the uh, low alarm, except these batteries, they, they have a, what's called a hard knee. When they drop, they drop almost instantly. They don't taper off at all. So I think we got enough juice here. We're going to drive it back and park it back where it was and uh, leave it the way we found it. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. 